my work is predominantly computer-generated animations that involve a lot of music, a lot of cinema genre, a lot of personal soliloquizing. Scarecrows <laughs> dressed in the, in the latest styles. Generally sort of lonely Those protagonists breaking the fourth wall and addressing us, the viewers, in more or less awkwardly intimate ways. 1973, 1961, 1958. They're videos 1958. that I want to be very imminent to the spectator. I want, I want people to be kind of aware of their bodies, aware of the kind of approach of the work to them, and of a kind of vulnerable, intimate experience, I suppose. There's a particular protagonist, a model, rather, a kind of surrogate who runs through most of the works. I mean, in one of the works, it's just his hands that appear. In Safe Conduct and in Hissa and in Happy Birthday, it's a figure who gets progressively more and more sort of beaten up. And I guess I wanted to convene a particular body of work, what, what only from this distance feels like a body of pieces, I suppose. The look of it all is intensely artificial and yet is kind of constantly striving to be perceived as realistic. I, di I didn't know. I'm sorry, I didn't know. Because of its kind of push towards realism and its massive failure at achieving that, it kind of creates a very, both uncanny but also kind of quite sympathetic situation, or pathetic, I guess. The technology is kind of both incidental to being contemporary, as in being now, wanting to find a way to speak of these things that was cleaving as close as possible to nowness, insofar as it will also just fall off very quickly. You know, the kind of the planned obsolescence of technology is also a kind of a way for me to think about mortality or uh, actual lived, intimate, physical embodied experience. Hmm. In a fortnight. Now, in a fortnight. Now.